Working. Yeah, okay, I think it's working. I think so. I haven't done this in a really, 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 really long time because January the 9th, our whole life turned on a dime when Wayne got the call to come get his kidney transplant. And um, life pretty much fell apart after that because it did not go well. He almost died the same day of the transplant because the new kidney had a bleed and then it just went from bad to worse. And so from January to March, he was in the hospital just about all the time. And uh, it's still not great. You know, the labs are starting to get better now, but he's not where he's supposed to be in recovery. And I um, don't know if, if it ever will be fully right, but I don't know. He's alive. So, you know, that's great. I mean, that's huge considering that he almost wasn't more than once. It was super scary stuff. But anyway, I don't want to talk about the transplant right now. I just wanted to say, if anybody is hearing this, that I'm trying to start doing this more, this vlogging thing, and it feels really, oh, did you hurt your hand? I don't reckon you did. You don't look like you did. Um, but it's awkward for me to do this. And I try to do it when nobody's here, and he's almost always here. And my studio is here. This is you know, my studio, try not to whiplash you, but all the way around, I know it's super messy, and he's in there, but he's not in there right now, so I'm in here, and, um, Cosmo wants to say hey, and Brian wants to say hey, Brian appeared when I was taking the trash out at the road, out, out there, and he was under a tree going right out there at the street where I rolled the um, trash can out and he meowed at me and he was so small and so skinny and so frail and and then I picked him up because we have stray cats out here I see if there's any on the porch right now and so I thought he was a stray cat so I brought him up here and you know they're making me a liar but usually there's cats out there there's just not right now anyway he didn't belong to them apparently because they shunned him and the next day was a Monday and it was really hot and then I took Wayne to his labs appointment and when we got back it was over an hour away so it was an hour there hour back an hour in between so we were gone three or four hours all together I can't remember if we had any other stops but anyway the poor cat was underneath the other car outside in the heat so I scooped him up and I brought him in and I planned on fattening him up and finding him a home, but he's still here. And my cats have accepted him, so it's okay. So Brian's a new addition. He's very loving. He's like the friendliest cat of all time. He wants to be hugged and he'll put his paws around your neck and just squeeze you like he's hugging you, not killing you. And um, Molly, she's lazing around. Benny's right here somewhere, but anyway, so over here is some of the art that I've been working on this summer. It's kind of dark in here. Been making peace flags again. I made these a really long time ago, and with everything going on this past summer, I just started making my peace flags again, and I really enjoyed making them, and they started to sell pretty good. That's not new, and I really had a good time with these. A really good time. So, yeah, oh, there's a little peek at Master Kitty. I love him. And so, uh, there is a piece that I sent to CBS recently. She liked it a lot. She hopes to use it soon. And uh, he's staring at me now. My studio is way more crowded now because I'm not practicing yoga as much because now I'm walk slash running um, four miles in the morning and then another mile after lunch. Oh, this is Moon Pie. She also loves love, but she only accepts it when she wants it. And she's so pretty. She's a pretty girl. So, let's see. Oh, I've been making these pouches. Also, this one. See that? It glows under UV light. I did that little stitching across the top there. I like that a lot. I call these peach pouch. Peace. 
pouch, not peach. Peace pouch, the peace pouch. She's really cool. Her eyes are glittery, and then under the UV light, she glows. I don't know. Let me see if it'll work, even though it's not it's not dark in here. Yesterday, it was dark in here Ugh, just about all day long. I loved it. It was a great day for making art. Yeah, okay. See? Okay, there's without the black light. There's with it. That's pretty cool, right? Yeah, I like that. I want to make some more um, black light art. I should be working on that right now. I started a project before um, lunch. And I got to check on it in a minute. Let me climb in here. And I think this is it. I'll show you what's in this box. Because I made these this week too. See, I got some new pens. I like these little cute food pens. I'm selling these in my Etsy shop. It's Don Collins Art. It's on Etsy and they are $5 and free shipping. And anytime anybody buys anything from me, they always, always, always get something for free. So aren't they cute? I mean, look, there's pie and a donut. That's not very plain, is it? And cake. Macaroon, a cupcake, lemonade, cat. Oh, see, she thinks they look tasty because she's licking her lips. So that's what I did this week. And uh, the black light pouch. And, um, gosh, it doesn't seem like much now, does it? Oh, I made tags for all these. I got more pins too. I got way more pins made than this. I just, these are the ones that I took time to get listed in my Etsy shop. Oh, there's another pouch. I forgot about that. I made this one too. I haven't listed this one yet. Yeah, I like that. The peace pouch. I said it right that time. A peach pouch that would be cool, cute too. I put bells on all my pouches because I like the energy that it stimulates. So I'm gonna stick this back down here. I put things back right away. They'll stay cleaned up. So yeah, this is this is what's happening in the studio now. It's way more crowded, but I don't need the floor space for my yoga mat. If I want to practice, then I can go outside or in the living room and. I just, I have so much pent up nervous energy, maybe, I don't know, I just, I, I prefer to go fast on the treadmill, and I can walk no matter the weather, so I don't have to wait for the weather to be nice to go walk outside, because it's been really hot, I mean, it's been very hot, super muggy, like 100% humidity on 100 degree days, and yeah, it's just not fun. But, um, I do need to clean up in here a little bit. And this is what it's looking like. It's a mess. There's that. And there's my round telephone. Love that. And Groot. And uh, there's Molly again. And my printer. I got another printer. I need to work into here somewhere. Because I'm trying to sell prints. There's all that artwork. I know it looks like I haven't created any art because this is the same art from my old videos, but I just really love it and I want to make some more of that. So yeah, see, it's just, just it's a mess, but it serves its purpose and I know mostly where everything is, so it's all, it's all good. Okay, so I'm going to go because I want to make some art before I have to run out at 4.30 and then the day just flies after that because I have to feed all my animals and do some chores and then it's time to make supper. So I hope you all, well, anybody reading this because it's not like a whole bunch of people looking at this ever if anybody. So I'm probably just talking to myself, but that's not new anyway. So anyway, if you are watching this, just remember if you're going through something yucky, if you're having a screaming meanie kind of day, just know that you're not by yourself. 
and it will pass. It will pass. Someday all this will be a memory. So, have a good day, y'all. Bye.